Hi, I'm Simon Bennett, Product Manager for VMware Fusion. Today we're going to be talking about two things. First of all, some of the new features we added with VMware Fusion 4.1, and also to deep dive into VMware Fusion from the point of view of a system administrator. VMware Fusion 4 is the best way to run Windows applications on a Mac, whether you're using a laptop, a desktop, or one of the new form factors Apple is offering, we think VMware Fusion is the most reliable way to run the Windows applications you need on the Mac that you love. But I wanted to start by walking through some of the key features and changes we made in VMware Fusion 4, in particular context to Mac OS Lion. The setup I have here today is a regular uh, iMac system. We chose this for the large screen, makes it a little bit easier to demo. But all of the features and capabilities I'll be walking through um, also work great on the MacBook Pro and MacBook Air, which is the machine I use every day. What we're trying to do with VMware Fusion is seamlessly deliver Windows applications to Macs, whether it's Internet Explorer, Microsoft Office, uh, a QuickBooks-style application, or something custom-written for your company, VMware Fusion is the way to deliver those applications to Macs in your environment. The experience we're going for with VMware Fusion 4 is totally seamless. We want your Windows applications to behave just as if they were Mac applications. Down in my dock here, I have a number of Mac applications. You can see that one of the applications I've added is Internet Explorer. I'm going to demonstrate the seamlessness of starting Internet Explorer on a Mac using VMware Fusion. You can see the Internet Explorer window is loaded immediately. It's sitting on my screen just like the other Mac applications. You can see it behaves um, just like the native uh, Keynote, which is what I'm using to show the slides here, um, but behaves otherwise just like uh, Internet Explorer would uh, on Windows. This is not an emulation. We're actually running Windows on the Mac at the same time as Mac OS. Being able to seamlessly integrate Windows applications with existing Mac applications and preserving the kinds of usability um, and productivity things that people choose Macs for in the first place is really important. The ability to copy and paste text between Windows and Mac applications, the ability to drag and drop files from one environment to the other, to very easily share work and work in both a Mac and a Windows environment uh, without context switching, without a lot of end user training, is really what we're trying to uh, deliver with VMware Fusion 4. And some of the changes that Apple introduced with Mac OS X Lion uh, really allow us to deliver on that at a whole new level with Fusion 4. What I demonstrated was a simple example of integrating a Windows application into the dock. Our integration goes much deeper than that. Launchpad is very popular with end users, particularly people who are coming from iPads. Here I have Launchpad where I've combined Mac and Windows applications. You can see Internet Explorer and Safari living uh, side by side. As an example, I'm just going to fire up Word, and you'll see I can have multiple Windows applications, in this case Word 2007 and IE coexisting with uh, native Mac applications. My Keynote application is still there. I'm going to use the trackpad here and see the windows overlap. Some of the um, more power users will obviously like to work with multiple desktops and spaces. You can see the Windows applications, again, behave just like Mac applications. One of the other changes very popular with uh, more advanced users is integration with Spotlight. I can now search across my Mac and my Windows applications and launch the particular application I need uh, just by selecting it from Spotlight. Uh, we've spent a lot of time making sure that the details are taken care of. Things like uh, cut and paste uh, work uniformly whether you're in Windows or Mac. Use your familiar uh, Command C to copy, Command V to paste. Um, this level of integration makes it really easy to work across the two environments as if they were one. One of the things we were very excited about when Mac OS Lion was announced was the ability to work with full screen applications. 
I'm going to demonstrate that by switching from Unity mode, which is the mode we were using, to full screen. In full screen mode, I can treat my Windows applications and my Mac applications as two separate spaces. I still get to copy and paste, drag and drop between them, but I can use a very intuitive swipe gesture to move from one environment to the other. I'm a Mac, I'm a PC, back to my Mac environment. The fact that we are sharing documents, whether it's downloads, um, desktop, or other locations between Windows and Mac means you have one place to look for your documents, but with a single swipe can move between a Windows environment and a Mac environment. This great, works great on the MacBook Air. It's a great form factor, great battery life. The screen is a little bit cramped. Full screen is the answer to that, and VMware Fusion's full screen mode brings the power of full screen to your Windows applications as well. There are a lot of other changes we've included in VMware Fusion 4 um, in the user interface, and I wanted to quickly walk through some of those. I'm going to drop out of full screen mode. You can see we're using the standard Lion full screen approach to move in and out of full screen, and drop into what we call single window mode. We spent a lot of time in Fusion 4 streamlining the single window experience, minimizing the amount of window chrome, making it easy uh, for people who want to work in this windowed type way to see their Windows applications, uh, really see the desktop shine through, and try and get Fusion out of the way as much as possible. We've revamped the settings portion of uh, Fusion to cl more closely reflect the behavior that we see in Mac system preferences. Again, this is to uh, make it a more intuitive experience, make it easier to add devices, modify settings for somebody who's comfortable in a Mac environment. One of the other areas we've invested heavily in Fusion 4 is the new snapshot viewer. Makes it much easier to work with multiple snapshots. A snapshot is a virtual machine state at a particular point in time. This is great for system administrators, developers, people who have to work with different versions of applications and OSs and need to quickly flip between different configurations, um, which is as easy as point and click with the new snapshot view. There are lots of other changes we made under the covers, support for virtualized Bluetooth devices, the ability to make use of shared CD and DVD devices, uh, particularly handy for things like the Air, which don't have a built-in optical drive. Uh, more details of the other changes we've made uh, can be found on the website, a link to which will be found at the end of the video.